guys, today we're back with another video for LD Films, and we're going to be doing showing the bass boat, and what I like about it, and what I don't like about it, and uh, stay tuned, and I hope y'all enjoy. Keep all of our fish. fish, yeah. Which, on uh, actually, if I was gonna say it right, we uh, my dad just fixed it this morning because it, it, uh, it got burnt out, so I left a button on, and so he fixed it this morning. And you'll see when we get over to that level, all right. And then over here, just another storage, just closet. another storage, just like this, just one? like that, yeah. And then, so when we come over to this area, this is kind of your driving area, we have this seat. These are pretty nice seats too. I like these seats a lot. And um, we have the throttle over here. It, it's okay. And you can do up and down like that. And then here over here, we have the, have our um, depth finder. It's a Garmin. And uh, we just put it on yesterday. Me and my dad, we stay up late trying to do that. It's pretty nice, but we're not in the water, so it won't really tell you all the depth and stuff. It's kind of wrong because we're on concrete in my garage. So that ain't gonna work too good. And then right here, we have, of course, the steering wheel, the RPMs, mile per hour, volts, so your battery and your fuel. The fuel is messed up, so that doesn't work. This is the your pump. I mean your uh, level pump, bilge pump, and then lights. Right here, you press the button to reset all of these. So if like something's not working right, you can reset it by pushing the button down and it'll work. Here's where you put your key. I'm not sure about this. I don't know, we never tried that out. So we'll move on. So right here, we have um, just some more storage. We keep this little light thing in here. So if you're going at night, and we can put anything to like there. And then right here you have where you can hold your rods. You strap it down and it goes all the way to the front. And then um, right here, this seat can go up front or up on the back. I usually put it on the back because on the front I like to be able to stand everywhere. And so um, this is usually on the back but I have to show the motor so I didn't really have it on there. I'm gonna put it on there real quick. Right there. Yeah. And it just sits in there. Hold up. Oh, I forgot to say, this thing right here, this is uh, to block the sun from your eyes when you're doing that, when you're riding. And then this right here is some more storage. And this storage in here. Um, this is the other live box I'm not. My dad filled it up this morning with water because it wasn't working, but you can definitely tell that's new water because it's, it's very cold. So, here's where you can put your other seat, but we don't put another seat right here because I like to be able to just stand here and cast and not worry about a seat hitting me. And right here, another storage. Another storage, yeah. 
and it, I, I like this. I like these two shorts the uh, these two shorts the most because if you're if you're already fishing up here, you just want to be able to reach down real quick and grab your box, and you don't have to want to go all the way to the back of the boat. So you're just right here. He always had this little rope where you could just tie off at a dock. I don't know why. You probably need a longer one. Something. Um, right here is our trolling motor. This is a motor guide magnum. Uh, it's we have it set to where you just press this. And it goes. And it goes. Then you would press this to move it up and down, but it's on stand right now, so it won't move. But that would move it up and down. Right here, we you could turn on your live wheel from here. Right there. Then you could do if say you're say you're running real quick and you're doing your uh just riding around and you want to get to a spot and fish it and you see that your motor's getting in the mud back there and you need to pick it up really quick, you just come back here and lift it up. And then, last but not least, our Garmin uh, depth finder from the front of the boat is right here. You can come over here and see. You can set it however you want, traditional, where it would show the bottom and stuff, or you could go back. Personally, I kind of like this one. It's kind of the this thing, but it also has a... Uh, this, I like that color because it can show you where the grass mats are and all that. And I just like it. And you can put your location down. Same with that one. That would be the one where I'd put my location down because that's the one where I drive. And so, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope y'all enjoyed the video, and we'll see y'all next time. Since I was young, they said I won't be nothing. Now they always say congratulations. Worked so hard, forgot how to vacation.